This is BBC World News. I'm Jamie Robertson. These are the headlines. United Nations experts say that North Korea's leaders should face prosecution for mass atrocities against their own people that could amount to genocide. Pyongyang rejects the accusations, saying human rights violations do not exist in the country. The man nominated to become Italy's Prime Minister, Matteo Renzi, has been outlining ambitious measures for change. The 39-year-old promises to tackle unemployment and push through economic reform. Swiss police say that they have arrested the co-pilot of an Ethiopian airliner who hijacked the plane to Geneva, where he wanted to seek asylum. Authorities say he locked himself in the cockpit when the pilot went to the toilet. And Afghan President Hamid Karzai has ordered changes to a controversial law which human rights campaigners said would make crimes of abuses within families almost impossible to pursue. Parliament must agree to amendments or begin discussions again. And those are the headlines on BBC World News.